Yep, guys, Manchester City will want to revenge their late defeat in the semi finals of the UEFA Champions League last season, guys, against Real Madrid, like that. And uh, the question now is can they stop this uh, Real Madrid side that have a different mentality and a different spirit when it comes to the Champions League, guys? Real Madrid, they have this elite mentality when it comes to the Champions League, like that. And you know they've always been spoilers when it comes to Manchester City winning the Champions League, guys. They knocked out Manuel Pellegrini's Manchester City side in the 2015-2016 UEFA Champions League in the same semi-finals, guys. And also last season like that in the semi-finals of the Champions League, uh, they, locked, they knocked out uh, Pep Guardiola's side. So Manchester City, despite their dominance in the Premier League, uh, winning four Premier League titles like that, uh, they haven't won the Champions League, guys. And this is their chance to actually get a triple you know winning the champions league winning the premier league and also the fa cup like that uh, but they, can they can they make it possible can can it can it actually be possible uh, like because guys real madrid uh, they're a different side when it comes to the champions league the, the mentality is different they they, they, they seem to grind results and to come back in, into games even when they're in losing position in the champions league like that so it's not going to be easy and uh, uh the, the La Liga has fallen at the hands of uh, Barcelona right now, and this is every, this is the the, the trophy that uh, Real Madrid will be hoping uh, to actually put uh, concentrate on, and this is what they love doing, guys. They love the Champions League and they love winning the Champions League, like that, guys. Uh, but Manchester City coming to this game, uh, yeah, in, in perfect form, in good form. They have Erling Haaland like that. With the coming of Erling Haaland, probably that uh, the curse can be changed in terms of like the Champions League for Manchester City because Erling Haaland has a good record when it comes to the Spanish side. I think he has gotten goals against the likes of Sevilla like that, and also he has been banging in goals, guys. The stats are crazy uh, like that. Uh, this this season but guys one thing is can 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 Real Madrid stop the firepower of Manchester City with the likes of Ellen Haaland, Alvarez like that uh, even Mares and the rest uh, I just feel like Real Madrid defense defensively they're not actually great but guys when it comes to the attack attacking aspect of the game it's too strong guys yeah they, they have elite players there in that attack you know Vinicius Junior, Benzema you know Rodrigo has been in, in sensational form as well like that so Manchester City also they need to have a, a, a good defense you know with Neta Ake I think he was injured yeah he was injured in that in that last game against was it Leeds United guys it's not going to be easy we have, uh, Manchester City need to defend properly from minute 1 to 90 look at what happened last year last last season the semi finals it was late late winners you know late goals from from real madrid to avoid the repeat of what happened last season guys manchester city they need to defend properly from minute one to 90 guys just to avoid late goals you know it was a late equalizer 90 minute like that from rojico sent it the, the the game was extra time and then real madrid won it 3-1 guys benzema and then benzema again with the penalty and extra time guys so real uh, manchester city you have to be careful the, the mentality of this Real Madrid side is a different uh, it's a different ball game when it comes to the Champions League like that yeah people so that is it here Sami SK Football I'll be coming live for the uh, stream and it's going to be a new commentary here like that make sure you tune in and you don't miss out guys it's going to be a, an increasingly exciting match here on the uh, uh, on, on the platform guys on youtube and in general when it comes to the ch champions league like that guys champions league history thanks for tuning in and i'm going to see you again bye for now